The Lagos State Government has formally received the letter of approval for the construction of the Lekki Airport. Minister of Aviation Hadi Siriki made the presentation to Governor Babajide Somwolu at this year's Lagos Economic Summit, tagged Ehingbeti 2022. Justin Akadonye tells us more. For over 20 years, the Lagos State Economic Summit, Tagged and Igbeti, has served as a beacon of change in helping to shape the state's public discourse over time. This year, the state is launching its development plan for the next 30 years to chart the path for sustainable socio-economic growth. On the top agenda is the construction of the Lekki International Airport. The Minister of Aviation, Hardy Sirika, is here with some cheering news as he presents a formal approval to the governor. May it be beneficial to Lagos, to, to its people, its future, its fortune, to the country and to humanity. Your Excellency. The minister believes that the best way Lagos State can be linked to the rest of the world is through infrastructure and civil aviation. For the governor, the Anigbeti summit, which is private sector driven, has to a large extent achieved its purpose through the adoption and implementation of innovative ideas and suggestions. I'd like to emphasize and highlight the importance and centrality of civil aviation in the scheme of things. The plan for 30 years is audacious. Yes, there is time, but all of us believe that Lagos can pull it. The summit has indeed served as a veritable convening platform for the best and the brightest in class. Stakeholders' engagement, idea focused, tailor made development for Lagosians. On its development plan, as ambitious as revenue projection looks, the government shares insight on how it intends to achieve it. Members of the organized private sector present speak on why they have identified with the state government on its plan. In terms of revenue, we are doing just about 2% of our GDP. Um, leading cities around the world from what we see, um, we need to do more than that. So this vision says we should move it up to 5%. If we move it up to 5%, there will be a significant amount of revenue. But it is not just the revenue of the state government that counts, because that revenue probably in taxes about 20% of the people's earnings. Because to the extent that we are talking about over 200 re resolutions over a number of years, and you have an over 90% uh, implementation, I, I don't think you can ask for anything more. And I was very impressed, I must say. The governor takes time to share thoughts and inputs of the youths, while other discussions centered on how Lagos can become the world's best investment destination. Justin Akadoni, Plus TV News, Lagos.